Hi, Drevis again. And uh, back to the painter's game. This is the one, two, three, fourth of five paintings in this game that Mark and I play um, that we just made up. It's really fun, by the way. <laughs> um, so this was Mark's painting. And I was to respond to this, and Mark keeps changing the dimensions. He tells me I need to do a 24 by 24 based on this. So that was fun. And um, what I decided, what my mind, my eye just kept going to this over and over again. As Mark zoomed in, um, he's going past the trees, and he's going out into this field. And I just kept looking at this field and all I could see was sunflowers. So that's, uh, I decided uh, since, since um, we've left the water behind now because Mark zoomed in and got amphibious and crawled up on the land uh, a couple paintings ago. So now I'm zooming in even further, but um, I'm also kind of going for the, the, the distance thing here to really pull. Um, trying to uh, do both up, up close and far away at the same time. And this is something that Mark introduced here, this half moon. Uh, so he introduced the, kind of like the concept of, or the, of time. He put time in there. So I decided to uh, move the moon about two weeks later, and probably this was done maybe a couple weeks later. And uh, so I have the full moon up there. Um, so th there you have it. Uh, the painter's game. It's a lot of fun.